Alright, I just <clears throat> purchased a domain a couple of days ago. Vicky'sStory.com <clears throat> And I'm going to show you how to point it on HostGator. It could be on any registrar like Namecheap, um, HostGator, um, is an ISP, it could be on GoDaddy. This particular situation, I'm purchasing it on Namecheap and hosting it on HostGator as a WordPress site. So first of all, I'm going to go to transfer DNS to web host. I need some DNS servers here. See it says use servers name. So I need custom DNS servers. So I'm going to go over to HostGator and down at the bottom here you'll see name servers when you log into your HostGator account. So you take your name servers and you just basically pop them in to your custom name server 67 and 68 and you hit save. Now what this does is this takes the domain that you purchased which was like you know nine dollars a year and it points it to your place where you're going to store your website. This points it to HostGator. So I go over to HostGator and I go add on a domain. Click add on a domain. And ask me for the domain. So I put my domain. Key story. Once a username, password, all that stuff. So you click add the domain and then it pops up. The account has been created and you go back home. So basically once it creates your account you go back home. You go to your Fantastico. Fantastico Deluxe. And now you can add WordPress. It's very simple. It's not complicated, it's not technical. You click on WordPress and you click New installation. And you choose your new domain. Give it a directory or leave it blank. Give it a username and password, a site description, and an email where you can be emailed. Pretty simple stuff, not too complicated. So after you decide what you're going to put on your description and your title, try and have a keyword that you want people to be looking for you or you looking for your information. Um, and you could find a keyword simply by going into Google and typing in, you know, a search term. Try and find one keyword or a long tail keyword, which is like three words. Um, that you want and put that in your title and your description. Um, that, that's pretty important that you want to get a keyword that every, people are going to be searching for. For example, if you were teaching people how to lose weight in their belly, you would put, you know, this information teaches you how to lose weight in your belly. <laughs> um, it's as simple as that in your description and in your title because you want to make sure that your keyword is relevant to your search terms. Once you put that in place, you hit finish and you'll see. You click finish and you're done. 
you have a WordPress site and everything's pointed. And as you can see, we're done. We now have a WordPress site. And if you go to yourdomain.com slash wp-admin, you can log in and it will look like this. Simply enter your username and password, log into your control panel. Once you log into WordPress, you'll see a dashboard similar to this. Let me make it a little more easier to read so you can see it. And if you want to change your appearance, um, you go to themes, install themes, and let's say you want pink. You could say pink and hit search. And you'll see all kinds of examples. And you can just choose, oh, I like this one. I want to choose pink. Install. See it's downloading, installing, successfully install. Activate. Bam. Now, I'm going to go visit the site. Look at that. Change the theme. Now it's pink. So you can play with that. You know, you can make it look different ways. Um, install theme say orange. There's lots of free themes on WordPress and you can even find more um, themes um, on WordPress.org. If you go to WordPress.org you can look in themes. You can find themes on Google. It's endless the choices that you want to do, the choices you want to make. Totally endless, endless amount of themes you want to find. I would start with colors if you really want to, you know, get a lot of choices. Colors are really easy to find, lots of different themes. If you start saying, you know, niche things like money, you might find some different things that are interesting, but your choices aren't going to be as vast as if you do colors. Um, let's say fun. You know, you could just play with it. See what you can find. You might be able to find some cool stuff. Some stuff that you really like. And how do you make a post? I want to show you. You go to post, you click add new. You say, hi, my name is Vicky, and I just put up my first post. Oh. Let's put that in description. And let's put title. my first post. Please comment and tell me about yourself. Publish. Bam! You are now a blogger. If you go back to your site, hit refresh, there's your blog, my first post. That's as complicated as it gets. You can make it more complicated and you can add SEO and if you want to learn more about that keep watching my videos and subscribe to my channel. I enjoyed making this for you. I hope you get inspired. I hope you want to tell your story. If you want to tell your story and you want to learn about becoming your own leader and leading a movement and leading a new change in your life, watch this video below. Just click the link and watch this video about the story that unfolds. You'll be quite amazed, impressed. You might cry, you might laugh. You'll definitely understand a lot about the world and you might want to make a change. Who knows? Click the link and uh, watch the story. Thank you.
and please subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it.